Alright, yo, what's good everyone? Nick Smith is back with another episode of the Los Angeles Lakers My Jam series. And you know what I realized? I don't need a face cam for every single episode. Let's just do this without a face cam for the next couple episodes. See how it rolls. And before I get started with the video, I want to set a like goal that I want you guys to achieve for the next episode of this series. Let's see if we can reach 550 likes for the next episode. So yeah, 550 likes for the next My Gem episode. But let's get into this. Um, let's first, since it's trade deadline, let's go to my YouTube comment section and let's find what the most... What the, you know, okay. Shout out to this guy right here. Shout out to Marlon Sloan. He had the most likes on his comment and it said, uh, get Jabari Parker and get him since mostly everyone goes after Wiggins and then later on you can team up with Wiggins and then get Devin Booker. Dude got some insane shooting attributes. So pretty much he just said go after Jabari Parker, which makes sense considering if we go to uh, Team Intel and then we go to the Bucks, which is right here. As you can see on the third dot point, it says this team is hoping to get Victor Oladipo, Hassan Whiteside and Josh Smith. We have Victor Oladipo. So we can make some trades with the Bucks and let's just try to get Jabari Parker. If that doesn't work out, there was some other trade call, not trade calls, but there's some other comments that uh, a lot of you guys want to see me get Joel Green. So we go after Joel Green. And pretty much, we just need a small forward. So many of you guys were saying that our team is nice, it's young, but we definitely need a small forward. So, yeah, I'm going to go after a small forward. And let's just start by going to the box and trying to get Jabari Parker. So, for those that don't know, we have literally no picks. And right now, this is 3 star for 3 star. Victor Oladipo is a higher rating than Jabari Parker. And if we go to who has higher potential, because that's going to make a huge difference, I think. Um, where is it? Actually, no, grades, right here. P uh, potential is a B for Victor Oladipo, but it's a B for Jabari Parker. So maybe we can make this trade go through. Let's try and submit it. Ooh. I think we're quite close, though. I think that we're quite close. They're both three stars, plus Oladipo is a better, like, he's higher, higher rated in this game. So let's throw in, uh, who's their worst player? This guy? Johnny O'Brien? And we'll give them Nick Young. And why wouldn't this trade go through? The Bucks would acquire, okay. So maybe they have to give up somebody with a higher salary. So let's acquire, let's just get Miles Plumley. Submit this trade. Ooh, okay. So yeah, we tried to go after Jabari. It didn't work out. But let's go after Joel Green because I know that a lot of you guys do want to see me go after Joel Green. And as a Heat fan, I'm happy with how Joel Green is playing in this uh, in in the preseason. He's been doing work. I like Joel Green. I liked him before we got him on the Heat, obviously, because he's just a beast in 2K, and he's just, yeah, I love Joel Green. Athletic, he's, he's, a, let's see if we can get Amari as well, if there's something for them. Nah, let's just get Green. Jordan Clarkson for Joel Green, on the Depot, Morrow, Nick Young, and Tyreek Black. This was the trade. I, I'm going to take this trade. We give up Nick Young, but we, I guess... I don't really want, but we're going to have to ship Birdman, because, I mean, he will be leaving us at the end of the year, but, uh, we'll just take this trade right here. We get Joe Green on the team. I like Joe Green. Um, the thing is, Birdman, he's on a pretty big contract, so, we'll try, we'll, I don't know. I guess we'll probably have to get rid of him right now. Uh, since we're at trade deadline, we might as well get rid of him. Joe Green and Oladipo. Joe Green can be our starting small forward for now. Uh, we'll switch Boogie and Sanders for now, and hopefully Randall comes back soon. And same with Kobe. But now we're we're gonna look to uh to ship uh Birdman away, unless nothing comes up, which I guess we'll keep him. A second round pick in Lavoie Allen. Uh, Bismack Biombo. I guess. 23 years old. Myers Leonard. 
They're giving me Myers Leonard. 87 shot three. I'll take this train to heartbeat. Okay, it was. So we get Myers Leonard for Birdman. I guess we save some salary with that trade. I think. Just he's gonna be in free agency next year, so or upcoming free agency. So we'll see how he plays. He has an 87 shot three, really good free throw rating. His rebounding is good on the defensive end, terrible on the offensive end. His defense isn't that great. But he'll come off the bench and we'll see what he does. But uh, I guess that's it. That's trade deadline. And let's simulate past trade deadline and see when Kobe comes back. And I'm pretty happy with you know the moves that we made. We acquired Myers Leonard. We got Joel Green. Obviously, we tried to get Javari Parker, but that didn't work out well. Uh, they didn't really want to uh, yeah, make the trade happen. Let's have a look, actually, if any other... Uh, where is the transaction report? If anything else happened. Nothing happened during trade deadline. It all kind of happened before trade deadline. So, yeah, there you go. Um, but I'm just waiting for Kobe to come back. The Bulls, are you going to be able to... Are you going to be able to get Kobe back in time? I think this might be it. Kobe Bryant, is he returning? Kobe? Yes, Kobe's back. Uh, let's adjust rotations. Now we have to put Kobe back in the lineup. Harold, you can't be starting. Uh, wow, how do we run this? Uh, we need a power forward. Randall's out injured. So I guess Harold's gonna have to take the starting spot at power forward. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, don't forget to leave a like. Let's see if we can reach 550 likes for the next My Jam episode. It's been your boy Nick Smith. We're up against the Bucks, a team that we know. Oh my goodness, are you kidding me right now? Wow. I was planning to end the episode on a good note. you got to be kidding me right now. Wow, so I guess Clarkson has to start at the point guard, which actually isn't that bad. Clarkson gets some more minutes, but it means that D'Antoni Russell and Julius Randle, both our rookies for the future, are out injured. Well, it's been Warning Smith. I'm out. <laughs> oh, man. Peace. Feeling like I gotta get it right now. Moving like a killer in the darkness out of sight now. On another level, so the devil wanna fight.